Thanks for stopping by. This is George and today I'm excited to talk about something a little unique, a little different to my channel. And that is about a brand new ebook that I have that's out now. It's available on Amazon.com as well as any other platform that sells ebooks. And it is called Debbie and Other Stories in the Helen of Mars Universe. Very excited about this. I put a lot of work into this and it's out there now. And I just wanted to take a few minutes to tell you about it, where it came from, what's in it, and what you can expect if you decide you want to check it out. So this story goes back a few years. What happened was I was working with a publisher on a totally different book series that is still under development today, actually. And at that time, uh, another author in the house I was working with came up with this really cool short story anthology concept and they called it Brave New Girls and what it is is a collection of a bunch of different short stories from many different authors and they all have to do with a teenage girl who uses science and math and STEM to save the day. That's the concept behind the story. So if you had a story in that vein you wanted to submit you could and I did that and luckily my story was accepted and that was the beginning of the Hell in the Mar universe. So I'll show you real quick. My story was called Helen of Mars and there's a little artwork for it and the story began on that page. And I was very happy to get accepted into the anthology. I just really enjoyed that. But the story Helen of Mars was bigger than just one story could contain. It was a concept that I knew I wanted to do more with than just this one story. So I'll give you a really quick idea what the concept is. So I had this idea about a future Mars, not too far from now, but a little bit in the future, where they have a bunch of different Mars rovers around the planet, and they're all going around and they're digging through the rocks to get precious ores and metals and things like valuable stuff out of the rock and Mars. And I had that idea and then my thought was what if just anyone could control them? What if it wasn't just NASA or the government or some you know big entity like that that controlled everything? What if it was put in the hands of the common person that could go up there and control this rover like they were controlling an avatar in a video game and the concept really stuck with me I thought wow I, I, I could do something with that. that that sounds like a lot of fun I want to explore that and so when the chance to write a story for Brave New Girls came up that's what I did I created my main character Helen and she is just an average teenager who by certain twists of fate ends up in a position where she's at the controls of one of these rovers on Mars and we start to find out that there's bad things going on up there. That there's more under the surface than what it seems. There's bad guys that got things they're doing with this concept that aren't good for the normal people that are controlling these rovers. Basically if you're somebody that does this you have to put up a lot of your own money and a lot of your own assets in order to buy the rights to go up there and hopefully find enough ore to make a profit for yourself. And so this main company in control of the whole thing, it's called Mars Corp. They, they pull all the strings and they give you kind of the keys to the kingdom, but what ends, ends up really happening is you become indebted to them. And you can never get enough ore or enough find enough stuff to get ahead. And you more or less become like an indentured servant to this company that's got other nefarious plans that eventually work their way out in the story. So that's the overall concept of the whole Helen of Mars universe. That's, that's the thought behind it. And so once we did the short story and we put it out there... Uh, my editor and I really fell in love with the concept. We knew there was more we could do with it. And so what we got out right now that you can go check out is a short story collection called Debbie and Other Stories in the Hell and the Mars Universe. And it is, like I said, a collection 
of short stories and novellas that expand on this concept, that give you different angles of this world, this future, and how the system works and how it affects people. So I got my Kindle right here. I, I like the, the Kindle that's not, not necessarily an iPad, but actually kind of looks like a book. So when you're reading it, I feel like I'm actually reading a, a, a leather-bound edition of something. So I, I got this a few years back, and I, I still use it to this day. Uh, but let me see. I'll bring up the table of contents page. So there's a table of contents, and you can see, hopefully, a little bit of a glare on my screen there, but this is a list of different stories that are in it. So there's The Arrival of Ares II, Debbie, Arena, Andromeda, Colossus, and then we have a bonus, the Helen of Mars story, the original that appeared in Brave New Girls, is actually a bonus story in the ebook at the very end of it. So like I said before, each story is designed to flesh out a little bit more of that world and give you different perspective of it. So Debbie, the, the story Debbie, it's actually D-E-B-B-I. It's an acronym that you, it gets explained in the story what that means. But that is kind of the linchpin of the whole thing. It stars Helen, our, our hero from the Brave New Girl story. She's the hero of that story. But the other stories give us different characters and different views and perspectives of this world. And so the idea is, is once you've completed reading the stories in this collection, you will have gotten a sense of, of the richness and the danger and, and the things that we're kind of setting up that we will move into in other stories. So we actually have the first full-length novel, Rover, it's called. It's on deck. It's going to be published in April of 2021. And we've done all the legwork, and we've done all the editing, and all the uh, things you got to do to get get it ready for publication. And it's coming then. But this short story collection, Debbie, is kind of like a prologue to that book. So if you were to read these, you would get a great sense of, of where we're going and what's in store when the novel ends. So... Again, this just came out in December, and it's just now the beginning of January. And I want to let you know about it, because I'm very excited. I put a lot of work into it. We've done some cool stories in there for you. They're fast-paced, they're sci-fi action. I'm very big into that sort of thing. So I just want to let you know about it. It's there. It exists. So as of today, as of this recording, you can go to Amazon... And it's free. Actually, you can go to anywhere where there's uh, ebooks for sale and it's free. We made it free because we want people to check it out, honestly. And so, yeah, at the time of this recording, you can go right now, download it for free. I will actually put a link in the notes below. Just click on that. It'll take you right to the Amazon page and just download it. And if you're watching this video a little bit, into the future from now, there will likely become a time when a charge will be put on it, but it's probably never going to be more than 99 cents to buy this. It's going to be very affordable. And so, yeah, I mean, it's it's out there right now. And I just got to say, I'm really excited about where we're going with this. This is just the beginning of some big ideas we have. Like I said before, we got the first novel, Rover is coming. It's gonna be out in April, 2021. And beyond that, we're planning future novellas, future books. I've written several of them. I have book two has been written. I'm deep into book three right now. I have many big ideas for this story, this concept. There's a lot of places we can go with it. And so that is, just kind of an introduction to this world. I just wanted you to know, and I just wanted to let you see a little bit of behind the scenes on that, where it came from, and uh, I hope you can give it a chance. Like I said before, as of today, I'm gonna put this video out today. I think it's the 2nd of January. It's free. And if you watch this video a little bit down the road, it's probably not gonna be more than 99 cents. Very easy to get, very affordable. Check it out. And uh, if you like it, 
maybe consider giving it a review. That's a big help to authors. The more reviews we get, the easier it is to get it in front of other eyes and other people. And I would like to really see this going uh, well into the future because, like I said, I have big plans, big ideas, big concepts coming at you with the series. Very excited about it. And I appreciate you taking the time to watch the video today. If you have any questions, comments, please let me know. I'll be happy to answer them. Uh, but, yeah, that's it. Debbie and other stories in the Helen of Mars universe, the first of many stories in this series. I believe it. I hope it. I have many thoughts and plans for more stories. They're coming at you, and this is the beginning of it. I hope you can check it out. Thanks again, as always, for tuning in. I really appreciate it. Until the next time, have a good one.